Welcome back to our kiddos. So glad you're all here. Today our Rooted in Abundance speaker is Catherine Townsend, who um, many of you know has been here for quite some time here at St. Michael's and is currently the treasurer of St. Michael's Vestry, but much more than that too, choir member, pilgrimage goer, etc. So Catherine, please. <coughs> Blessed are the ones who trust in the Lord. They are like a tree planted by water that sends out its roots by the stream and does not fear when heat comes, for its leaves remain green and is not anxious in the year of drought, for it does not cease to bear fruit. These words from Jeremiah are the theme for our stewardship campaign this year, and it is a good one to me. I like trees. And that's a good thing because I have many trees in my yard, mostly oaks, but also sweet gum, beech, tulip poplar, red bud, eastern red cedar, pawpaw. Some have been there since before I moved in 20 years ago. A couple I have added, and some have just shown up on their own. A lot of trees for a small suburban lot, but they have found what they need to survive and thrive. Good soil, sunlight, nourishment. Each of us can be like these trees, rooting down in the good soil next to the stream. And what do we need to be nourished and thrive? For me, three things stand out, family, friends, and faith. My family and friends strengthen me and help me to thrive. Through my faith, I pray that I grow strong and produce fruit in good times and in difficult times. Family drew me to St. Michael's originally, and the friends I have here and the spiritual nourishment are the reasons I am still here. Each of us can also be the soil, the good ground by the stream, where others can find nourishment and strength. You can do this on your own in your own daily life as well as here at church. St. Michael's and its parishioners are good soil in Bon Air. Through the faith and active efforts of many, we provide nourishment both physically and spiritually. Some examples are the food pantry and other feeding ministries, Bible studies, adult forum, and other learning opportunities, the weekly church service with the Eucharist, the new dinner church that is coming soon, as well as the new table groups that will be forming later this month. And you don't have to be in an official ministry, though. You can just reach out and say hello. I encourage all of us to trust in the Lord and send down our roots in his good soil. This will assist us to live abundant lives and lead others to find their place by the stream of God's good grace. Thank you. Uh -huh. 